Hey guys, I'm LB, and uh, I don't understand the point of making those deadly pools more than one block deep. Like, why? Curious, curious. According to Greg, theoretically, there's an Earth out there made entirely of money. Plus, since there's an infinite number of Earths, that means there's an infinite number of money planets. So, I've done the math, and I figure the odds of finding this thing are 100%. Not now, Greg. That doesn't mean I want you to stop <laughs> testing. But do keep an eye out for the money verse. And let me be clear, I'm talking about US currency. You find a peso verse, you just keep walking. <laughs> I like how Greg was trying to correct his flawed logic. <laughs> okay, let's see. Turrets, deadly goo, cubes. And uh I think this one is just kind of on randomly. Hmm. Well, there are the turrets. Oh. Uh. How about this? Take that. I guess it took it. <laughs> uh. What about that other turret, though? Okay. Uh, I guess we do button parkour. Yips, I missed. Let's try that one more time. There we go. Oh wait, there's a cube already in here? I didn't notice that before. There we go. Oh, okay, yeah. Okay, so... This is the cube we can get again. I'm gonna put this one that we can't get again... over here. And then... Come on. There we go. This guy can go uh there. Come on. And I think that should do it. I'm still waiting to find one of those maps that looks like it's made in Puzzle Maker and then when you go through the exit it turns out it's made in hammer and it's like a whole nother test you have to do. I haven't found one yet, but anyway, thanks for watching, guys. I will see you in another episode. Goodbye!